Welcome back to <laughs> <laughs> EW Legal. Today I'm here with Chris. Um, we're both law students, we've been friends for nearly three years and we're on the same course together. So today we're doing a bit of a collab and we're talking about Chris's experiences as a mature student. I'm 54 years old. <laughs> to say that I am 26 years old. What did you do before you came to uni? So before I came to university I worked in a warehouse 10 hour shifts and as a 54 year old it was not good for my back so I obviously I aspired to be something more. I feel like there's a real stigma around men being hard workers and feeling the need to uphold this social construct of coming out of school, being the breadwinners, working, working really long hours and actually potentially that's not what they want or not what they really want to aspire to but they feel s stuck in this construct. When did you decide that you wanted to go to university? When I was working at the warehouse I remember looking out the door loading bay window and I remember seeing the nine to five office workers, nicely dressed and finishing at five o'clock when I had started just half an hour before and would finish at two o'clock in the morning. Um, so I remember seeing them and thinking, you know, they've got it easy. There, there must be more opportunity than loading up lorry trailer. And so then I thought, I need to find this opportunity. What would you say is your, was your biggest challenge going into university as a mature student? I think my biggest challenge was trying to relate to students younger than me. <laughs> Do you have any regrets not starting university at a younger age? It would have been good for me to start at a younger age. I wouldn't have to be working 10 hour shifts in a warehouse, but I don't regret it. I think it's good at the age that I am now. How do you think your life compares to younger students at university? I tend to put the kettle on way more often than I should <laughs> um, and read... <laughs> So boring. I spend a lot more time in my pyjamas and, you know, I like to be tucked up in bed with a cup of cocoa. <laughs> <laughs> What's the best thing about being a mature student? The best thing about being a mature student is, um... Uh, <laughs> Shit this, American accent. I don't, uh... Hmm. Good question. <laughs> Probably knowing your priorities and your responsibilities and what's the what's best for your future and you know what's best for you at the time so rather than perhaps having a weekend bender you might spend the friday evening reading a paper on equity and trust especially as you become older and especially in the legal profession which we all know drags and drags on and, uh, <laughs> It's never ending. So there is also a certain pressure. Um, and I feel that pressure. With it. <laughs> what are your aspirations? I am an aspiring barrister. So um, I hope to work towards being called to the bar. What he means by bar is that the bar brew dog, you know, that bar. <laughs> what advice would you give to mature students who were in your position? Well, I would say don't be too put off or concerned with the age of the majority of students. It's always good to understand where you want to be in five years time. I think a lot of people often ask, um, you know, am I too old to start in this profession or, or get involved? And the answer is no, um, unless you're in your sort of mid 60s then perhaps you might be a bit older than some of the uh, students on the course. There's no pressure to socialise and um, lower yourself to the age of the 
first year university student. I think that this is a big problem in society in general in that people think things are fixed and rarely people come out of their comfort zone and this is something that I've learned recently that actually coming out of your comfort zone does make you a lot happier. Being a mature student and going from a job to university at a later stage when you're arguably comfortable in your job already is coming out of your comfort zone. It's doing something vastly different. It's something very unique to do but I would say also very rewarding. Yeah, I uh, agree with that and um... There aren't many mature students, um, but those that are mature, um, they, they know what they want to do and what their aspirations and what's best for them is, so yes. And so arguably, probably better time to go to university if you actually really want to make the most of that and get a career because so many people come to university and just party and I think you've got to find a real a real balance. <laughs> All of those older people watching this have never got the chance to go to university. It's not too late. Head over to my legal page Law Students Unite. Thanks for watching.